so you can go also the geojson files you can if you have a geojson or json file you can add also the geojson file because i didn't have it at the moment in my hand to build the geojson files but even can you can just simply call the geojson files and then build the geojson object into the into the into the your into the your into these maps depending if you have a geojson file or kml file json files then you just read the json files and build your geometry objects that's that's i did in, in my one of the one of the projects like they have no no post gis database they have only the file system the json files and then we need to be build this read the json file and build this uh, the maps but in the later case later later screencast i will show you how can you can integrate how can you how can you save uh, how can you where the uh, problems uh, uh, i don't know where's the problem we did it like this way uh, let's see yes um, and we can start stand pm is it still missing Let's see. Let's see what's happening. Ah, it was the our syntax error. So, so we 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 comment out this information. So we we can build. It's possible to build uh, the build also the your circle vectors. You just you need to be LC circles, and you have to report the central coordinate points, and you have to be how many uh, yeah, how many how many uh, radi radius of the the meters set like meters scales and five five thousand fifty thousand meters. Maybe that means the five and fifty kilometers, and then you had the maps just like simple circles maybe you need to some buffering some some geo filtering of geo search functionalities and that case you need to build extra uh, circle layers maybe mean the to look for something into the inside the one kilometer two kilometer five kilometers then that's that's why i say this is the one of the idea how can you build the all the geometry all the layers vector layers and into the your base layers that's i mean to give it to you really clear ideas so let's see how it's look like so you see the you, you circle is created properly that's what i mean so if you maybe you need extra circles to miss such one kilometer by central points and look for how many how many peeling station is there how many gas station is there how many inhabitants is there depending for the all cases that you need to be so we we, we build the points we need the power line string we did the polygons now with the circles you this is the use cases that i, I mean here so depending how you mean how you use, use it the all the use cases I try to give it to you to integrate the use case into the your developments so then we can you can even though it can be the rectangle so we build the points lines polygons circles and then we can put it also the 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 poly the uh, the rectangular you can also build the rectangular also into the into the your your maps So now let's see. Twenty rectangulars will build so rectangular case. You have the like a rectangular definitions. We have the bundles and the bundle definitions for 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 the coordinates points bundles. So it has a let long and it has a long to two uh, to rectangular bundles. So and then it has a has a L rectangular bundles what the code bundles the boundaries bundle means the boundaries the rectangular boundary the uh, top uh, top left and then maybe bottom right so we have a top left uh, coordinate points latitude longitude and bottom right latitude longitude so and then and we try to here so depending what the use cases for maybe the plot creations maybe the plot is rectangular simply if you are city area there's well designed plots that means it's rectangular or other cases it will be the polygons but i give it to you the possibilities you how can you can how can you build uh, the all the geometry into the your geometry layer the vector layer into the your base maps
to all the functionalities in, in the in the existing the into the liplet libraries so let's have a run it so you see the it's, it's just application is running you see the all the rectangulars from the, i mean this is the uh, left top coordinates points and then bottom right coordinates points for this uh, this code in the rectangulars uh, so that i mean so maybe the plots be smaller or bigger doesn't matter how it is called you can build the rectangular also the into the into the into the your your maps into the base maps so so let let's make make it more a little bit a little more let's see how is the effect is the color maybe we can do is color like i don't know uh, maybe uh, white white color is there you can change the width also the the for the for the rectangulars let's see the oh color is, is the white colors we cannot see it maybe we can need to change the color uh, maybe the uh, green green color so this is a green color so all the possibility you can do the your css or style css you can include the inline css or your external css this is also possible because i didn't have enough time to write down this external css to build this rectangular so we build the points lines polygons and circles and then rectangular depending the your use cases how can you use this 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 these functionalities uh, the use cases into the your applications i mean that one so now we have the different just like like make some some funny things with this here uh, like like here uh, a little bit funny but it's it's interesting so we'd like to see the some videos some videos into the into the into the maps this is really video video over overlay that means you have a base layers and you have to be play the videos i mean let's say I try to visualize uh, one inter traffic intersection. I cite cameras and I try to visualize the information into the maps. That's the idea. Uh, how can you, I integrate this? How can you be visualize it? Or you can play some movies or, or animals movies in the different part of the world. Or for my case, maybe some 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 dummy example. But I give it to you. How can you play? How can you? add the video layer into the base maps that's the idea to give it to you to to recover every part of the open layers or the possibility that's open layer heads so if i go to the open layers uh, in the in the downloads of the tutorials i don't know not here tutorials or overview so no it's this open layers i mean somewhere they have the definitions of the the plugging so i mean that's the part of that i mean so we have overlay overlay data we have a dynamic data static data and 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 then here overlay for the different overlay type of the overlay and you have the different mouse the event functionalities and routing functionality geocoding functionality there's a many more functionalities display maps and then you have the base maps all things but somewhere i saw the the all information so all the formats of the of the data the plugging possibility you can you can look for the detailed information you have a vector overlay video overlay uh, overlay 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 display overlay data uh, overlay data so i saw somewhere but i forget it to the video overlay to show you was the video overlay uh, information is available but you can look for this the the the, the good page uh, for the leaflet documentations so we 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 we, we passed the, the url uh, this is the url for the overlay